Saturday here for NorCal V's and uh, we're back in downtown San Jose and uh, we have a, a cutout. It's an exterior cutout. Um, and so what we're going to do is we're going to jump from the roof, we're going to tie off and then go onto the ledge and then we'll lean over and uh, cut those bees. Early in the summer we did a removal between those two columns right there where we actually cut a hole from the top um, through that, that little ledge there and uh, cut through the metal, cut through the plywood, and then uh, pulled all the comb and the bees. It was, it was a pretty big, big colony. They actually went down the wall too, so that was a pretty good job. So, um, so that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna cone off, get everything safe, and uh, yeah, and uh, we're gonna get Charles here to, uh, <laughs> to hang over the edge and, uh, and cut those guys and vacuum them up, and I'll be on the roof and install them. Let's check it out. Charles up there pulling up the equipment we're going to need. And uh, he's harnessed and tied off. And then uh, we're actually going to lay on this wider edge and lean down and uh, start cutting that comb out. And uh, I'll be up there. He'll be handing it to me. and. We're actually, since it's kind of small, we're just going to be sticking it in a bucket. Um, keep as many of the bees on as we can as we cut it. And then uh, we'll put the screen, we have a screen lid on the bucket, and we'll bring them home and uh, install them on frames when we get home. All right, we got Charles all harnessed in there. And it's tied off down in there. Steel anchor bolt. He's gonna vacuum some of the outside bees first, and then he's gonna start cutting the comb and handing it to me. And uh, we'll put it in the bucket. Alright, I think that's all I can get. Okay. And then get these girls to their new home. was looking for the queen for her highness and when I don't install the bees on a frame right on the job which I usually don't do on these smaller ones I just leave the bees on the brood to help keep it warm and they actually ride in in the front of the truck with me <laughs> so uh, we make sure to keep them as warm as possible there we have her we got the queen Charles spotted her. I reached down there and grabbed her. We're gonna mark her and put her in this cage, and uh, so we know this one's gonna make it. All there right. She is with her fresh coat of paint. <laughs> All right. Good job, Charles, spotting her, my man. Eww. All right. With the queen in her cage, we're gonna just put her down in here with the rest of the bees, and then uh, we'll keep putting on the comb. And uh, like I said, when we're done, put on the screen lid and then they, they ride in the front of the truck <laughs> with us. It's actually a beautiful, nice day out here. And uh, um, it's gonna be actually warm. And then when we get home, we'll install them in frames and put her in her new home. Awesome blossom. All right, Surfer Ray here and that's a wrap. This was actually a pretty easy one and uh, we got all the bees, well we got most of the bees, we got the queen, we got the brood. As you can see there's only a few foragers left. We'll dissipate in the next uh, few days and uh, yeah, this one's a wrap. Surfer Ray with NorCal Bees and thanks for watching. Alright, Surfer Ray here and uh, we are getting ready to install these bees that we just did that cutout um, in downtown San Jose. So what I got here is an apiary site where uh, I had two hives here, one died out, and so I pulled the honey supers from this one. I put on the two empty brood supers on top of there and um, put a queen excluder, keep the queen down, 
keep my uh, comb fresh and so now we're gonna blow the bees out of this and then uh, set it back up over here and install um, this comb here we actually gonna get at least one more frame we got the queen in the cage and so uh, once we get the other combs installed in the frame we will uh, drop them into the bottom deep add the queen and uh, dump the bees that we vacuumed up and uh, it'll be ready to take off and uh, produce lots of honey next year here we got a couple baby bees being born right now just coming out there's another one there's three of them coming out brand new bees so i guess we're gonna have to put this comb in here somewhere too <laughs> there's another one on that side <laughs> all right we installed those two frames of brood in here we put in all the bees we got the best combs out of the two deeps and uh we're gonna get ready to release the queen here. Come on, little lady. It's time to go to your new home. This is the land of plenty, not like downtown San Jose. Come on. There you go, there's all your sister, daughters. And there she goes. All right, well that's a wrap from uh, San Jose to Pacifica. And I'm sure these bees will do really good here. This is actually a really productive site. So, uh, yeah, and they had tons of nectar in there from these guys. Oh, you can see it all up here. Wow. Mmm, that is tasty. All right. So, uh, that's it.